yeah, with the Michael Harding paints, I mean, the first thing I really, I don't know if I can remember the first painting I did. I think it was a portrait sketch, uh, a female portrait sketch, but, um, so it was kind of a dark room, so I couldn't really see the color that great, but, uh, you know, the texture and the consistency was really, um, really nice. And, uh, you know, it worked great for the way I paint a portrait, which, um, which was, you know, I could just get the paint direct, you know, just use it straight from the tube without thinning it, down, thinning it down with the medium. Uh, it was a good, just a good texture for painting the portrait of the figure. I mean, if there's one that I just had to, um, you know, if I had to do without, I'll accept one color. I mean, I'd probably pick the Kremnitz white. It seems to be the most useful, um, and that goes in almost every, you know, at least a little bit goes in almost every mixture. Yeah, every, yeah. Every once in a while, every time I see Michael and Karen Neal, give me some new colors to try out, and uh, there was there was one, and I I think it was amethyst. I forget now. I wish I could remember. It was kind of this dark purple color, and uh, and so I had it for a little while. And I didn't really didn't really know where to use it because um, I never really used any color like that. But so I did a I had this portrait commission that had a like a southwest had some mesas in the background that were in shadow, and uh, you know they had to be really dark in value, but I still needed some some chroma in there, and uh, yeah, it worked really great. It was just such a great color because it could go really dark and it just had a lot of power and warmth to it. sort of running out of space because I don't I put out a lot of paint so like each color takes up a lot of real estate on my palette um, so I don't have a lot of room to add colors uh, sometimes I will but usually um, you know at this point I'll just kind of swap I'll just try a different you know just take something else off and you know I've got like my my, my staple palette that I put out every time but um, I mean it's fun to just try new colors even even if just to experiment, you know, swap out a different green with the green I normally use. I might take out Viridian and put, uh, just use some other uh, type of green. Mm -hmm.